Hello Aquarius, welcome to another love reading. This one will be all about the person that you're thinking about or connecting with at this time. What are they thinking about you? How do they feel about you? Um, how do they view this connection? How are they viewing you at this time? We'll also look at their intentions towards you and what do they wish they could tell you. So we're going to get right into it for Aquarius. What messages do we have for Aquarius here? In love. Let me shuffle. That'd be great. We're going to look at your energies first and we'll jump into the reading. Messages for Aquarius regarding love. What messages do you have for Aquarius? Messages for Aquarius. Tell me about Aquarius. What are their energies in this connection? That was way too many. Aquarius, keep in mind. Okay. <laughs> Aquarius, keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it will not resonate with everyone watching. All right, what messages do you have for Aquarius spirit? What are their energies in this connection? There you go. Hostilities. What? What about your person? Tell me about the person that Aquarius is dealing with. What are their energies? My cards want to talk. Patience. So while you're dealing with something, your, your person's having to be patient. Perhaps this is something to do with timing, balance. What's going on in this connection? I'm also picking up like maybe you're just feeling very guarded right now envy what is going on <laughs> bottom of the deck the sun so i feel like someone's looking in on you and i feel like they're hating aquarius either someone's hating on your connection or perhaps there's drama surrounding your connection you feel like you're always on guard you're always like fighting the opposition or facing some sort of challenge and i think it's because people are almost like this negative energy surrounding your connection there could even be jealousy issues in your connection as well we'll see for aquarius tell me more about these energies tell me more about these energies for aquarius please more about these energies please spirit for Aquarius tell me more about hostilities the full reverse this is about being reckless not really planning very well delays in a new beginning or delays in having a new journey of some sort or going on a journey it could also mean like not being really prepared or naive eight of cups this is about leaving you could have been leaving or needing to leave a situation that was difficult aquarius and i think you're facing some sort of challenges there tell me about patience Tell me about patience. The Emperor, Aries energy. The Emperor is someone who likes order, has authority, is decisive, doesn't let emotions guide their decision making. Usually it could be someone like a boss or a leader. Could even be a parent. So this person that you're dealing with could be an Aries or have some sort of you know, Aries in their chart. But what I'm picking up on is almost like they are taking their time bringing something back into balance. Why is Envy here? Let's see. Tell me about Envy. The Tower Reverse. Someone's trying to avoid a tower moment or prepare for a tower that's coming. Page of Cups. Interesting. 
This could be somebody that wants to reconcile with you. I don't know why I'm picking this up, but it's almost like this could be somebody that wants to apologize in order to avoid a tower. Let's see. Should I use this deck? Let's get some more information for Aquarius. Let me clarify these energies for Aquarius. Aquarius, like I said earlier, this will not resonate with every Aquarius watching. Uh, don't try to make this fit if it's not your story. Check out my other readings for Aquarius. I have a whole playlist. But if this is resonating for you in some way, leave me a comment. Let me know how it's resonating for you. I love hearing from you guys on how the readings resonate. All right, let's see. Tell me more about Aquarius. What other energies in this connection, spirit? Strength, being strong, having courage, bringing things into control. Leo energy. Tell me more about Aquarius. Nine of Cups reverse. Some sort of wish hasn't been granted or there is a lack of satisfaction, a lack of contentment, a lack of emotional fulfillment. Tell me more for Aquarius. How, what are they thinking or feeling when it comes to this connection? The Emperor reverse. Interesting. Hmm, five of wands, definitely. You could be, you know, this hostility situation, it could just be drama with this other person. Maybe they're controlling or maybe they're just have a uh, bad temper or perhaps there's something here that you're trying to make happen, but the challenge is too great. Yeah, you're not happy, Aquarius. Whatever this is, you're not happy. And by the way, Aquarius, I have you on this side. Have your person on the other, but feel free to flip them because if they resonate, because the energies can be flipped. But to avoid confusion, this is you for me. So I feel like you're just not happy where you are at or with what you're dealing with. Tell me about the person that Aquarius is in a connection with spirit. What are their energies in this connection? This one. Five of Pentacles reverse. Three of Cups. This person wants to come together with you, have some sort of reunion, come out of the cold. Tell me more about this person. Energies, please. Yeah, this person, I feel like they want to... Wow, and there's a tower. I feel like they th th some sort of tower happened either because of this person or um, or you caused a tower because of this person's actions. A tower has occurred or is under ongoing here, or you know someone's trying to avoid it, but it's going to happen. Um, this person could be breadcrumbing you. It could be that they can't really give you something, or they're very um, it's very unbalanced energy here where you give more than this other person or vice versa i'm gonna to have to clear i'm gonna clarify all of these this is what i'm seeing so far tell me about what's going on in this connection queen of wands aries leo sagittarius energy what is going on in this connection spirit Two of Cups reverse. Yeah, there could have been some sort of separation with this person in the past. Six of Cups reverse. There you are, Aquarius, the star. Someone I feel wants to heal this. It may have been it might have been because of deception um, or jealousy or trust issues. I'm saying I'm thinking like something to do with trust issues, or someone's outside of your connection hating and interfering. Let's see. Let's clarify these energies. Help me clarify these energies. For Aquarius, please.
Let me clarify these energies for Aquarius. Let's see. Why is the Queen of Wands here? Someone wants something or there's attraction, chemistry. Someone wants to make something happen. Let's see. Why is the Queen of Wands here? Judgment. A second chance. Could be that somebody wants some sort of a rebirth, resurrection. Has had some sort of an awakening. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. Eight of Wands reverse. Lack of movement, lack of communication, blocked communication. Tell me about the Queen of Wands. Four of Cups reverse. Someone's had a change of heart. They've changed their mind about something or they're having renewed interest in something. So this could go, you know, either way, either you want a second chance with this person or this person wants a second chance with you. But I have a feeling like um, the other person might not feel the same way or might not want the same thing. Why is this Eight of Wands reverse? Why is this Eight of Wands reverse? Chariot. There's someone wants to make some sort of a move, but it's like it's not really happening. And I have the Nine of Cups reversed. So I feel like this is someone's wish or desire to move on, to move forward, but they're like stuck. Cancer energy. Tell me about the Two of Cups reverse. Why is this here? That is way too many. Tell me about the Two of Cups reverse. Why is the Two of Cups reverse? Three of coin did want to come out. Why is the two of cups reversed? It's like someone wants to work on something, like on a separation. Hangman reverse, three of wands. Again with the waiting. Patiently waiting and working on something. This person could have, um, there, there could be communication or a lot. Um, I feel like communication is not the best, but someone's trying to communicate in this connection. I don't know if it's you or this other person, but one of you is trying to communicate on this. But with the hangman reverse, it's like, it's like someone's working on untangling themselves and they're just waiting for the right time. Why is this Three of Pentacles here? Why is this Three of Pentacles here? Two of Wands. Yeah, it's like they're working on, it's like moving down a new path. And there's Eight of Coin, definitely. This is what they're working on. Someone's focused in this, in this connection, I feel like someone's focused on a new path or choosing a new path because of a separation or maybe they're trying to get this connection back and they know they have to go about it a different way. Interesting. Let me clarify another deck for your energies. Let me clarify these messages. Aquarius. Aquarius, if this is resonating, let me know down in the comments. What is going on here? What are the hostilities you're facing? Tell me about strength. Three of Wands reverse, impatience, um, frustration, mistakes. Missing an opportunity, missing the boat. Why is the eight of, not the eight. Why is strength here? It is an eight, but why is strength here? Seven of cups, choices. So I feel like something didn't work out and now it's like someone wants to choose something else. Hermit reverse, Virgo energy. Maybe you're just very withdrawn here or have ran away or something like that. Perhaps there's um, you've been ghosted or you've, you're ghosting someone else. There's confusion here. 
I feel like you don't really know what to do. It's like you're still figuring something out and it's taking you a long time to figure something out. Could be regarding a Leo, could be regarding bringing something under control. Why is the Nine of Cups reverse? The Six of Wands felt kind of like this, so I'm going to just take it like that. Why is it's not, I feel like you weren't really successful at something. Why is it you didn't really get your wish? Not eight of cups and nine. So you want to be free. You want to walk away. You want to be free. I have here the eight of cups with the nine of pentacles. You want to be single. You want to be free. You want to go after your nine of cups. But I don't feel like you were, you've were. you been successful. With the emperor reverse, maybe you haven't had the... This is out of your control. Why is the emperor reverse? Or you're dealing with someone difficult. Why is the Emperor reverse? Six of Pentacles reverse. Six of Pentacles reverse on both sides. Why is the Emperor reverse? You're not able to bring something back into balance. And again, it's because of the hostilities or the challenges or like you're fighting for something here or fighting against someone. I feel like you're trying to leave a situation or you're trying to be free of something. And for some reason, you're facing opposition. Ace of Swords. Perhaps you've blocked someone or are trying to cut something out of your life, Aquarius. Why is this Five of Pentacles reverse? The world reverse, lack of closure, unfinished business. This person, I feel like they they don't want to close a cycle. Wow, Wheel of Fortune. This is like a big change. Serendipity, divine timing, things coming back into like, you know, in your favor. Why is the Five of Pentacles reverse? The Emperor reverse again. The Emperor showed up in three different decks. Twice reverse, once upright. This person, I feel like they're wanting to create some sort of change, but they're unable to as well. They want to come back out of the cold, and for some reason they're unable to. It's like you're mirroring each other. You're both in the same boat here. Why is the Three of Cups... Oh my gosh, hopefully this person wasn't hiding something from you, Aquarius. Pisces energy with the moon. They could have been juggling two people, two different things, and maybe they didn't tell you that. Or perhaps they something was in the dark about a decision they made. Could have been some sort of interference. I have the Three of Cups here. Why is the Three of Cups here? Can I get one more? Something was an illusion or hidden underneath the surface. I got two. Judgment reverse and three of pentacles reverse. Exactly. This person could have had someone else. And that's why they weren't able to give you something, Aquarius. Perhaps you've had enough of that and have decided to move on and this person doesn't want that to happen. But this person made a bad judgment call and I feel like they're paying for it. Three of cups at the bottom again. This could be about another person or about coming together. Maybe they screwed up a reunion here. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles reverse. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles reverse, please. Oh my gosh, Three of Cups again. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles reverse, Queen of Wands again. Tell me about the Six of Pentacles reverse, please. Can I get one more? Page of Pentacles reverse. And five of wands at the bottom again. So I feel like there has just been conflict or drama with this person due to someone else. 
I think there, this person, there, things have been unbalanced. It hasn't been fair to you in some way, or you feel like it hasn't been fair to you. This person hasn't been able to give you anything even small. And um, perhaps there's a lot of like drinking or going out, but no actual commitment. But I feel like this is someone else, this Queen of Wands. You know, and it could be that this person wants you, wants like there's a very like physical attraction or chemistry here. Um, but when it comes to commitment, it doesn't, it's not working. I feel like someone's trying to move away from what hasn't worked out. And I think that might be you. I think you're sick of the drama. You just want love. I mean, maybe you're still attached to this in some way because of love. I feel like there have been trust issues in this connection because of what's happened. And someone's trying to avoid a tower due to their own, like, the consequences of their actions. What a mess. So let's see, what is the potential outcome? I'm going to pull some cards here. What is the potential outcome for Aquarius and this other person? And then your future, please, Spirit. potential outcome so in the extended we're going to look at their true intentions towards you we're going to clarify the outcome a little bit further um, we're going to look at what they're secretly thinking or feeling about you and what advice spirit has so if this is resonating for you oh my gosh three of cups reverse eight of wands there's some sort of interference here and someone's trying to communicate with you i feel like they're going to you know send you a message or a text or something like that yeah, they want to recover what's been lost. Ten of Wands reversed. I feel like there's a lot of baggage here. Like someone, I feel you possibly just wants this done, or just to, you don't want to fight anymore. You don't want to. It, it should. I just heard it shouldn't be so hard. Like this is just too hard, and you feel like you're being kept from having a free beginning. You you feel like you can't really be be free of this person. Or this situation I don't know if it's because you love this person and you still are in this in some way or why but um, I feel like it's like you want to move on and someone doesn't want that to happen because it means they would lose you 